All five Oklahoma seats for the U.S. House are up for grabs tonight, but there's only one race without an incumbent, and that's right here in District 1. To work senior reporter Christy Maria is following all five of those races for us tonight. And Chris, what are the expectations tonight? Well, Karen, with incumbent Jim Bridenstine now running NASA, his seat in District 1 will either go to Republican Kevin Hearn or Democrat Tim Gilpin. Now, Hearn was out in Tulsa today shaking hands and meeting voters before the polls closed. He told me he wants to build on the national job growth and continue to create more opportunity for Oklahomans. I think this opportunity to do what we're seeing happen right now is put Americans back to work. What we're seeing is you know, the greatest job growth we've seen probably in the history of our country. Gilpin was making last minute calls at campaign headquarters, asking voters for their support at the polls. And he told me he wants to bring positive change to the district and be a different voice in the House. I like to think that this is our chance to do better. Really, more importantly, I feel good about the chance to ch send something different to Congress. Now, the District 2 race is the most crowded in the state tonight, with Republican incumbent Mark Wayne Mullen trying to hold off three opponents, Democrat Jason Nichols, Libertarian Richard Castaldo, and Independent candidate John Foreman. Now, in District 3, Republican incumbent Frank Lucas takes on Democrat Frankie Robbins. Lucas first took office for the 3rd District in 2003. And Republican incumbent Tom Cole takes on two challengers in District 4, Democrat Mary Bannon and independent candidate Ruby Peters. Cole was elected to Congress in 2002. And finally, in the 5th District, Republican incumbent Steve Russell takes on Democratic challenger Kendra Horn. Horn grabbed the nomination by defeating fellow Democrat Tom Guild in the August primary runoff. And those are all five U.S. House races in Oklahoma tonight. We'll keep you updated with the results as vote counts begin to come in. Christy Maria, two works for you.